Welcome to my YouTube channel. Now, I have a reaction to Megan the Stallion opening up and performing at the Democratic rally in support of Kamala Harris. Yes, Megan the Stallion. So initially, when I saw the video and I read the comments on the Shade Room and I saw the negative why and all of this, and I'm sitting back saying, you know, you know, was Gladys Knight busy? You know, she could have been on the midnight train to Georgia. Uh, was Patti LaBelle um, busy? And then I thought about it, just like, you know, Sleepy Joe, they got him up out of there. Um, you know, maybe they resonate with a younger culture, you know, but you got to understand that Atlanta is a big state. OK, and it's condensed, you know, Fulton County, Atlanta, you know, those areas are pretty much high populated when it comes to blacks. But in a sense of Megan the Stallion pulling up, opening up for a presidential election campaign. And I said to myself, wow, I mean, did we did we fumble the ball? Did we drop? And I thought about the Trump side and I was watching Born in the USA and Kid Rock and all that. But then I had a little change of heart. Like I said, I don't have skin in the game. You know, I'm a nonpartisan independent. I'm a theocrat. And it's fun just looking at both sides. But I'm going, go, I'm going to have to give the nod, at least this one, to the Democratic side. Because if you really think about it, she challenged uh, Kamala Harris, uh, challenged Trump to a debate. And he will be a fool to debate a black woman. It's kind of like having a, a murder trial and you the murderer and you go on, on the stand and testify under oath. No, I don't think you should do that. So, like I said, as a black man, I'm going to tell this camp, hey, listen, it, it, this is just clickbait. This is says make African-Americans black again. OK, this is not I'm not a MAGA. I'm a MABA. OK, a nonpartisan independent, a judge in the political courtroom, a mediator between the two rivaling tribes. But this situation right here, I got to give the nod to the Democrats because. I, I saw the videos, you know, I was like, you know, in my feelings. But like I said, it's not flesh and blood, powers of principalities. But when I looked at the video, it did something to me. So if I was, I got to give the nod to the, to the, uh, to the Harris administration for this one. Because uh, this is Megan Thee Stallion performing at a rally at the, you know, in uh, Georgia, in Atlanta yesterday. I'm going to have a problem with somebody calling me out when I start watching it, I'm like, wait a minute. Uh, uh -oh. Hey, I gotta get a Democrat system. Hey. Man, I gotta pause it right there. But listen, man, I gotta get a nod to the Democratic Party because when I watch the Trump rally, they got these cowboys and all that, but. Uh, they resonate to a different crowd. So listen, we don't know the outcome, but like I said, if Trump debates Kamala Harris, he'll be a fool because a black man can't out debate no sister. I'm just saying. So with that being said, and man, that's my reaction to Megan Thee Stallion pulling up, performing at the rally in support of Kamala Harris in Atlanta, Georgia. With that being said, man, hit those like, share, subscribe, and keep tapping in, hit those notifications because we're going up. Better Black America TV. Peace out.